Hi, welcome today to Adulting with a Disability. Today I would like to discuss why I am taking photos on a budget and my end goal in this. Welcome back. My taking photos of what I wear every day started as a motivation to get me dressed for the day after my epic stay in the hospital, which I will share in another video. I noticed that if I got ready for the day, I would feel so much better. The act of doing this also aided my recovery. By putting a photo of myself on Facebook kept me accountable. The act of finding photos that I was inspired to emulate also aided my fun, creativity and adventure. What then evolved was that people were interested in where I got my clothes from. And when I shared that I got them on a budget, they wanted to know where and how much. And so there has been an evolution. The fact that most photo shoots are done standing up, I wanted to challenge this by showing what they look like when I sat down. Because this is the way I do things. And the fact that everyone stood up bothered me a little bit. Nah, he did it bothered me a lot. Because when you stand up, you don't get the baggy pocket and you don't get the riding up of clothes that are long. So I wanted to show how I need to buy clothes without pockets in the sides and also how I need to buy shorter shirts that look good when you're sitting down. I'm showing my clothes in the way that suit me. Crop shirts and jackets and pants with no pockets and elastic waistbands. I'm still wanting to play with fashion but I need to do it on my terms in a way that makes me look good. My end goal is awareness of what limited clothing there is for people that sit in wheelchairs. I want to be able to also broaden people's aspects and directives towards what they can wear and what they can buy and what they can do with the clothes and also what they look like. I want to normalise what clothes look like when you're sitting down. Alright, well, I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Adulting with a Disability, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.